Welcome to St George's RAF Chapel of Remembrance in Biggin Hill on today, the 10th of July. Gracious God, on this day, the 80th anniversary of the start of the Battle of Britain, we give thanks once more for the freedoms we enjoy, which that battle preserved for us and the world. We give thanks for the bravery and service of the members of the Royal Air Force and their allied air forces, as well as those who supported them from the land, especially for those who gave their lives so that we might live to the full. So let us pray for the nations of the world and their leaders, praying especially for the Queen and government of this land. We pray that they may uphold the value of freedom and that they may preserve peace and the dignity of human rights. Let us pray for the peoples and communities of the world. We pray for those whose lives are torn apart through warfare, violence and terrorism. And we pray for the work of all peacekeepers and reconcilers. Let us pray for all those who serve today in the Royal Air Force and the Forces of the Crown, especially for those currently on active military duty. We pray for their safety and well-being as we give thanks for their devotion and courage. Let us give thanks to God for all those whose memory we recall today, for the veterans of civilian and military life who fearlessly gave of their all in the service of their country and neighbour during the Battle of Britain. As we give thanks to God for the freedom and peace in which we live, we dedicate ourselves to building a world in which there is justice and peace for all, and where men, women and children love their neighbours as themselves, and we all play our part in establishing justice in our community. So mindful of all that has been, and commending our future into the hands of Almighty God, we pray the prayer that Jesus himself taught us. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power and the glory, for ever and ever. Amen. Go forth into the world in peace, be of good courage, Hold fast that which is good, render to no one evil for evil, strengthen the faint-hearted, support the weak, help the afflicted, honour all people, love and serve the Lord, rejoicing in the power of the Holy Spirit and the blessing of God Almighty, the Father, the Son and the Holy Spirit be upon you and remain with you and all those you love, now and forever. Amen.